Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to add a printer or scanner on your Windows 11 computer. So this should be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I'd actually recommend doing would have really nothing to do with Windows and more to do with your specific printer and its manufacturer. I would go on to Google and look up your printer manufacturer and see if there are any available driver downloads or software packages so you can just download and install to your computer that way you have the most up-to-date drivers and usually you'll have a nice friendly user interface to do scanning with make copies it's all bundled in one I'd look into that first next thing you can try it actually would be to go ahead and use the Windows add a printer setup and I'll show you guys a couple of different ways on how to do it and we're gonna go ahead and jump right into it and we're gonna start off by right clicking on the start button and you want to select the settings Select on the left side Bluetooth and devices. And then on the right side, you want to go locate where it says printers and scanners and go ahead and left click on that. Select the add a device button. Make sure your printer is turned on. So printer or scanner, make sure it's turned on here. And it will search for it again if it's a Wi Fi connected printer or if it's plugged in like through a USB port. So if the printer that I want is enlisted, you can select the add manually button. You can walk through these steps right here. Alternatively, you can also open up the start menu and type in control panel. Best match, come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. And you would select the view by and select category view. Underneath hardware and sound, you would select add a device. Again, you'd see if there anything more connected to the computer and you'd walk through those steps. If you do open up hardware and sound here and then select underneath devices and printers, go ahead and select that. You can select add a printer as well. So this will be a little bit more specific here. See if it connects to your Wi-Fi. So make sure your printer is turned on. And if it is a wireless printer, make sure you've typed in your Wi-Fi credentials into the printer itself so it's connected to your network. And if it doesn't populate in this list here, once it's done loading, you can select that the printer I want is enlisted, in which case then it opens up the same dialog screen that we saw back with the modern UI settings. So this screen should look very familiar to everybody here. And again, you would walk through the steps based on your own situation, your computer, your, I shouldn't say your computer, your printer, your scanner, and again, for your specific configuration here. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. Do hope that I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.